Um, this is by Ruth. Uh, Ruth, this is just gorgeous. I just love what she did with her flowers in this vase. She um, made three types of flowers. One is just from some fiber, and then this is a neat button. And, and then these are buttons. And behind those, she put some micro beads in the spaces between the buttons. I think it just looks just beautiful. And then some metal letters that I love with some bling at the top of those. Very clever. Love that. I think, actually, I think this is the back of the book. I think I'm holding it wrong because I'm upside down with the video camera here. This is the front, I believe. Um, and it, with this too, she she bought this spray, um, really cute on the on the book here, and put it in a little pouch. And um, she has the word love, really neat ribbon on the on the ring, and the ring is brown, and a really pretty charm hanging from ribbon on there, really pretty. But this says love, and then she's got three hearts here cut out with ribbon that goes through this buckle on up. That's a neat buckle. I don't know where she got that from. I'll have to ask her. And then this page, this is very pretty, very romantic, aged kind of look. I love it. I love this bracket here. And I like what she did inside of it. I have to ask her what, where she, what she did with all these things because this is really neat. I think until she was having fun. Everybody had fun with this challenge. And then this button, uh, I'm assuming that this opens. Give me a minute here, okay. Hard to tell. Hard to tell. Okay, does it go this way? Um, all right, I'm having trouble with this, but I know it opens. And um, there's a place where it, with decorative paper inside and she can put some photos. And I know, I think this opens as well over here on this side. And so it's the same on the other side, but just different. Well, I don't know if you can see that or not, but if you can open that up, <laughs> which um, I'll figure out eventually, but for time's sake, I'm not going to bother. I think the hairs on this fiber are getting stuck together and I can't get it off. But anyway, beautiful page, lots of space in there for journaling and for photos. This is the next page and here's those letters again with the little hole on the top. This is really neat what she did here. Kiss. And then these hearts are raised with um, some uh, pearlized stuff on the edges of the hearts. It looks really neat. And there's an X. Eyelet. I never, I've never seen those. That's kind of neat. And then there's this page. Some really pretty ephemera on that. And here comes some metal. This is a gorgeous page. I love this little ring here and the key. Key says dreams. Keyhole. This says follow your heart. I love these little ripped up little things on the pages. Makes it look really neat. Nice effect. And then uh, that's what the clip is holding. This, I think this is a little book. Let me see. I think it is. Okay, it's pages. It's just um, pieces of cardstock that she can put photos on or journal on. Get that hair off of there. Very nice. And then this box is a Velcro closure. Okay, and I think this book comes out. Okay, it does. And there's some different pages in here for photos or for journaling. Very pretty. Love this paper. I think this is Garden Party. A big tablet of cardstock. I think it's the garden party one. 
Um, oh, this is a beautiful flower. So she did this with pockets into the vase, and they're actually flowers. Isn't that neat? So that one comes out, there's a flower, and this one comes out, and that's a flower. Very clever. I'm always amazed at um, when we do challenges and how different everybody's um, books come, or, or our challenges finish. It's just always really nice to watch. Uh, this is really pretty. She cut out some holes on the butterfly, see? Um, looks like she did some neat stuff on there. I can't really tell what, but it looks like cellophane behind the butterfly. But one of the butterflies, she's got two butterflies here. The top one, she cut out some of the holes. And the bottom one is as it was. And then, um, and then she dimensionally taped it down. So it sticks up, the top butterfly sticks up. And then there's some kind of clear stuff behind the holes. I don't know what that is. Anyway, she bound her little book with ribbon here. And uh, so it's just a little flap for journaling or a photo. And then here, she's got a fleur-de-lis cut out. And a few things inside this pocket. This here is just a little, little mini book that you can put some um, photos, journaling. And there's quite a few pages in there. So that's kind of neat. Nice to have. And then these are some tags. And here's the fleur-de-lis tag. And then this tag has some lips in the center and some circles on the edges. Very pretty. And then another pouch pocket. The pouch pocket is really kind of neat. I think she like cut it in half and used part of it on the cover and the other part here in the back page. And then there's that back page again. So that's Ruth. So thanks for watching. And uh, there's three more to come. Thanks.